Banana too. Welcome to another episode of How Much Do You Know. Today we talk about survival. How much do you know? Today's episode, we want you to pick up life-saving skills to better prepare yourself during emergency situations. So today's contestants are here, and they are. Hello, my name is KG, and I'm gonna win. Hello, everyone. I am CC. <laughs> Meanwhile, I am very not prepared. Uh, that's Hara. This is you, so CC, and then me, me, I'm Thomas. First question. Are you guys ready? What does CPR stand for? Go. <laughs> I don't even know how to spell it. Eh. Don't need to spell correct one. They okay lah. Can you read out your answers, please? <laughs> Crushing person's respiratory. Wrong. <laughs> but it's actually that is what you're doing. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, true. Ah. Mine is cardiac press res resuscitation. <laughs> I feel mine makes the most sense. Eh. Wow. Mine is oh, yes. cardiac pulmonary resuscitation. Eh, just the one. So from the study one. The correct answer is cardio. Pulmonary resuscitation. Cardio pulmonary. And I think Thomas got the closest. Closest doesn't mean correct. Doesn't no, mean that closest correct. doesn't mean correct. But I don't do closest answer. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> um. So nobody gets a point. You guys have messed up. What is the compression rate for effective CPR? you just write one. There was an episode in the office. They actually said this. The number is mentioned because. See, <laughs> hundred. Oh, hundred. No. Which part of that song says a hundred? The bridge. Uh -huh. na, 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 na. No, no, I don't know. I, it feels like a hundred beats per minute. Uh -huh. Yeah, it does feel like. It's... And a hundred is correct. Yes! yes. What are the three ways you can contact the police? Police! Police! <laughs> police! <laughs> okay, show me your answers in three, a two, one. Well, news SG secure app. <laughs> Bingo! Confirm! Oh, okay, nice. <laughs> Call and go to the police station. Mine is walk to station, so the same as that. Commit <laughs> a crime! Commit a crime. That's a very practical way to contact the police. Sure. Uh, and call 999. <laughs> is there such a thing called text there? I, I think <laughs> there is it. So what's the number if you want to call? Nine. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. Nine nine nine. Oh, nine nine nine. Nine one one. You call. Um. Okay. There's few ways, different ways. Of course, you can walk into the police station. You can also call the police at nine nine nine. You can text the police at seven one nine 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 if you can't talk. Uh huh. You can also submit information via SG Secure mobile app. Um, committing a crime is not cool, so Thomas does not get a point. And um, bonus point for using the app. Put in butter or oil on burnt wounds would help in the healing process. I don't know about help, but I know it tastes better. Lah. <laughs> Show me your answer. Alright, man. Alright. False, true, true. Yeah, okay, so putting butter or another greasy substance on a burnt wound would trap heat on your skin, causing damage to it. So it's false. <laughs> Causing damage to it. Yeah. Which of the below has the greatest source of protein per serving? A. Mealworm. B. Salmon. C. Egg. D. Lizard. Oh, we all same answer. Three, two, one. A. 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 And it's correct. Yay. Yay! Next question. How long can you go without food? I know it's above seven because yeah, I've actually done it before without food. So you just drink water. Yeah. Water is the one, water is like 3 days I think. Mm. Mm -hmm. But food, I, I actually think Thomas is right, 14 days. I think Thomas is right. The correct answer is, you'll be surprised, 21 days. Oh. Yeah, see, it's, it's, it's a bad number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, yeah, 14 yeah. or 21, yeah, yeah, yeah. somewhere. I, yeah. But this one, I, I guess it's very subjective. Some people probably can do longer, some people probably I one day. I think so. It depends on their body, Yeah, uh, I guess. <laughs> like whether you go a lot of festivals. <laughs> they can survive that long! <laughs> Next question, in the event of a snake bite, what would you do? Rush to make a tourniquet. B, wash the bite. C, suck out the venom. <laughs> D, spit on the bite. <laughs> suck out the venom, very movie-ish. What, what's tourniquet? Tourniquet is you tie something really tight above the wound so that the blood doesn't oh, go it's, up. It's A lah, it's A. <laughs> it's A lah, it's A. 
So everybody think it's A? Yes. The answer is not A. Oh no. no. I'll give you another chance. Besides A? Suck out the blood. <laughs> C, suck out the venom. D, spit on the wound. If we can't live, at least make our death romantic. D, D, C. D, spit. The answer is... Because saliva has antiseptic. Yes, that's true though. Natural thingy thingy. Interesting. The answer is not C. <laughs> And not B. Oh huh? my god! The answer is B. Wash the wash wood. the wood. Wash the wood. Huh? Just like any other insect bite. Waiting for the SCDF crew to arrive would be a better option than performing CPR on a cardiac re arrest victim. True or false? False. false. True. False. True. Ah. True. Why? Anyways, now the house there all got the machine. What AD. machine is that? Ah, the AED. <laughs> what you to say? Don't, don't need to do CPR. Just use the machine. Okay. True. It's false. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! I tried lah, I tried. <laughs> if you further injured a cardiac arrest victim or broke his ribs while doing CPR, are you liable for the injury? I hope, I hope the answer is false because it will Trying encourage more people to help. Yes. yes. And the answer is no, you're not liable. That's good! Woohoo! It's free That's good. That's good. That's good. That's We're good. wrong, but we feel good. Yeah. Next question In the event of a terrorist attack, what should you do? Run. Police! Police! Run. <laughs> Ours is book in. <laughs> I give you a hint RHT. Run, hide, tackle. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm right. Run, hide, tell police. <laughs> No, I think the first two you should be right. Yeah. Hey, really? Oh, oh, run, yeah. run, hide. hide. Explain your answers. Together lah, together. After KG's joke, run, hide seems very plausible. Mm -hmm. And followed by copying Priscilla's last <laughs> option text. of texting also makes a lot of sense because yeah, if you're yeah, under yeah. the table, you only can text, you can't say run, anything. Run, hide, text. Sounds good. Um, the correct answer, exact answer should be run, hide, tell. Eh! Oh! Oh! I said tell! Tell police! But I think tax police is an, a form of telling as well. So oh. I'll say that all three of you are correct. Oh my god! For every minute that passes without CPR, what is the percentage decrease in the chance of survival? Is this like closest number wins or? There is no. Sure, this one I give you closest number wins. It's like, it's like I know like 3 4 minutes is brain dead, right? Because no more oxygen. You can be brain dead, dead and dead. your organs can still go correct, on. Correct, correct. Your heart is more important. I know. But the heart must go on. Let's see the answer. 25, 30 and... 31.26%. <laughs> right, I'll tell you the answer. Answer is 10%. Oh! So we can take our time now. <laughs> <laughs> no! What are the four steps to using a fire extinguisher? Four Stop, steps. drop and roll. <laughs> that is to extinguish fire on you! <laughs> I give you a hint. No, no hint. No hint. No hint. Give me hint. I'm not talking about it. Ready? Show me your answers. Especially those who didn't want the hint. Chris is the first one. Let's let's go. Remove it from the rack. Nice. <laughs> Remove the pin. Nice. <laughs> That's a pin. Grab the handle. <laughs> spray it like a hero. Thomas. Mine is you press the handle, then you can pull the ring, ma. You pull the ring. Then oh, after that, you aim at the base of the fire and then you squeeze. Wow, sounds legit eh, yours. Mine is pull pin, aim nozzle, take deep breath, <laughs> press the gapper. Gapper. <laughs> uh... Alright, the hint that I was going to give you guys was PASS. P-A-S-S. -S. I got P-A-T-P. The last S is what? Uh, success. <laughs> <laughs> Shoot! <laughs> The last one is Sweet! <laughs> if it doesn't work, you spit! Sweet! Oh, sweet! Sweeping motion! Oh. Last question, I give you 10 points if you get it correctly. If you get it wrong, minus 5. Huh? Nice enough, right? In times of emergency, what are the top 5 things you would take with you first? Must get all 5 correct. Handphone. Starting from Thomas. Alright, I got handphone, water, utility knife, so like the Swiss army knife, some food like canned food or like snacks or whatever, and then first aid. Wrong! Please? 
Passport. <laughs> Dog. No. Water. Handphone. Toilet paper. Wrong. KG? ID, wallet. Some sort of identification. Phone. Water bottle. Weapon. Food. What's the other list about? These are these things that I would normally take. Camera, phone, MacBook, food, loved ones. Wrong. And in the event of an emergency... It's a trick question! You don't take anything. You don't run. take anything. You need to run. Oh my god, I thought of that! Eh? But I didn't... I, I, okay, never mind. You didn't think they were snakes, right? Yeah! And after a not so uh, intensive competition... Actually, it's quite intense because the scores are quite close. We have one winner. And that winner is... How much do you Keiji Umehara! Alright, that's it for today's episode. Thank you so much! Bye! Bye! If you want to find out how you can learn life-saving skills, please visit the SG Secure website or download the SG Secure app. How much do you know? Wow, banana too.